uh, by my own immediate uh, Anglican Christian community, but I was also wonderfully welcomed by other new Christian communities who had settled in Coventry. And then I found myself wonderfully and marvelously welcomed by other faith communities, and not least by uh, Sabir and uh, Sanjay and Mona and uh, many other people here. And uh, that meant so much to me. As you say, there was a sense that I've heard people saying, well, you're a stranger, but we think you might be an enrichment to us. And to be able to join the new communities here and um, try to welcome strangers among us, knowing that they will indeed be a, an enrichment has been a great, great joy for me. Coventry, as we've heard, is not only a city of peace and reconciliation, but as we've been reminded, a, a city of sanctuary. As a follower of Jesus, who was himself, as a tiny child, a refugee. I honor the work of those who seek to welcome those who are refugees and to join in that. And we've seen a, a wonderful example of the drummers here who came as asylum seekers now playing the beat together. There are the, in our city, Asylum seekers who have been denied asylum, and yet they know they cannot return to their own origins of countries of origins because they will be in great danger there. The Coventry Refugee and Migrant Centre has launched the Hope Fund. That's such an important word. Thank you, Sabir, for reminding us of the importance of that word. There are some people in our community who are beginning to lose hope because they are on the point of destitution, going under the radar of any other sources of help. The Hope Fund is here to help them. I commend it to you. I think you may have leaflets uh, in front of you. May I just finally conclude by adding my thanks to the event planning committee and the Coventry Refugee and Migrant Centre. This is a little idea I had when I thought the Archbishop was coming. What do we do with him on a Saturday night? We need a party. So I phoned up my dear friend in the Bassey and said, what do you think about laying on a party for the Archbishop of Canterbury? And that's all I had to say. And then it's the easiest party I've been involved in, it just happened. But I would like to say an especial thank you to you, for Binder Bassley is someone who makes things happen in Coventry. I dare to say he is someone God makes things happen around. Thank you everyone, thank you for those wonderful performances, thank you for the food that you have laid before us. May God bless you.